cake for breakfast. Mm -hmm. Still Christmas as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> I'm glad you're back in one piece. Yeah. Just a few things to deal with. Is there any films you want to go and see? I was thinking me, you, popcorn, hot dogs, the works. Not unless you're too old to go to the cinema with your dad. I'll never be too old for <laughs> Morning. Sleep well? Yeah, yeah. You? Yeah, I did. Right, well, uh, I'm going to get on. And uh, you text me about that film, yeah? Stop moaning, mother. I should have bought everyone vouchers for Christmas if you didn't want to get dragged round the sales. No, you just want to get me out of here so I don't upset geriatric pregnant Barbie. No, I don't want to get you out of here. I just want to spend a nice bit of time with my family over the festive period. Oh, I'm looking forward to it. Okay. Of course you are. You see a bit of tinsel, you go bandy. Go on. Here we go. Thanks. I don't suppose you got much sleep. I've been looking over my shoulder for months. Waiting for it to all come out. Keanu had Louise and Peggy, they were his priority. Mine was Phil, Danny and the baby. I've planned a big family Christmas celebration. I'm looking forward to the future and it all comes crashing down on me. Phil's more angry than I've ever seen him, Linda. He called to Keanu. It's Danny you need to think about. I can't stop thinking about him. You won't be able to stay mad at you forever. Yeah. I'm going to go over there and get him today. Are you sure that's a good idea? I need my boy, Linda. God knows what poison Phil's putting in his head. Look, but Dennis is a teenage boy. Right, he'll come round. He just needs a bit of time. So if it was Ollie, you just sit back and bide your time? No. No. No, I wouldn't stop until I had him back in my arms. Then you can start mine as long as you want. I suppose Patrick never forgives me. Then I'll have to put your name on the council form. <laughs> so glad I got you, you know. Detail. Cheers, Marie. <laughs> <laughs> um, Patrick, can we just... What was that about? Oh, it's, uh, it's nothing. Denise? Oh, well, I suppose you're going to find out sooner or later, but... Um... Cherie. She's run off with another black. And apparently, that's all my fault. You're joking. No. Well, you think you know someone, eh? Um, but wait, why is that your fault? I know Jack reckons that you lash out at the person closest to you. It's me, innit? I'm sorry if I was a bit much about Keanu yesterday. Or his mum, of course you're worried. You're a Mitchell. I wouldn't expect anything else from you. I might be a Mitchell, but I'm still a mum. You heard about Sharon? Oh, what's she done there? Staying at the Vic. Yeah, Shirley's fuming and all. Oh, why does she get to stick around when my boy's gone? You know, this whole mess, it's all her fault. Yeah, but I can't blame Sharon, though. If Lexi turned her back on me, I'd stick around and all. Have you heard from Keanu yet? No, I'm trying not to think about it. Oh, you'll hear from him soon. Yeah, and Billy's not worried, and if anyone knows Phil, he does. So it's just a question of waiting. That's the spirit? Yeah. And it's a shame about the renewal not happening, though, isn't it? His family could do with something happy. It'll happen soon. Yeah. And by then, maybe Shane Taylor will feel a bit more comfortable about it all. Oh, yeah. She uh, told you about that? It's like I told her. It's a renewal. It's not like she's having to decide whether to marry you or not, is it? 